my goal is to try to be a leader for the team, and um, I think it's worked out so far. I, I mean, I try to get into as many camps as I can, you know, when Hoffenheim releases me, but I think I'm definitely a good part of the group here. I'm trying to do my best every camp I come in, and anytime you get called in the national team, it's a great honor to represent your country. He is a great leader on the field. Uh, it's something that we need. You know, in the last U20 group, we had, you know, Will Trapp on the field, who is an excellent leader as well. And I think Russell can follow in those footsteps. You know, he's, he has created a path for himself overseas. He's obviously highly valued at his club at Hoffenheim because he is the captain of the team. And we see him in the same type of role here. You know, I don't know if necessarily he will be the captain of the team or not. That's still open for us at this point. But he will definitely be a leader on this team. At Hoffenheim, I've captained the U17s, and then this past year it was U19s with um, the 95 age group, and I was captain again. And we were lucky enough to go to the national title and win the German championship. So that was definitely something special and a good stepping stone in my career so far. The club definitely translates into the national team because that's where you're at all year round. I mean, it's always exciting to see how players have gotten better over the years. Coming into camp, you see this player has gotten better technically and tactically. And I mean, I think it's good for the team, you know. I'm always happy when you see someone like come in and they've improved at the club level and they can come in and better the team because at the end of the day, it's what about the team and how, how the team performs. And for me, for example, playing in the German championships and playoffs and stuff was definitely um, a good experience. And playing in front of a crowd in a pro stadium was something I took personal and I am going to use that to further myself in my career. I remember the first time I went to Germany we went and watched the U17 game and I was like, I don't know how I'll ever get used to this pace and stuff. And first couple months were obviously hard, but then I uh, was able to feel comfortable and kind of adapt to the culture, I'd say. You know, it's not easy for some of our players uh, to give up a full scholarship to, you know, big time universities in order to pursue a career overseas. That's maybe not all that rewarding at first. And I think he sees the, the, the long-term goal for himself and he knows that in order to get there, he's gonna to have to work hard, and, and it looks like he's taking that path, so I give him a lot of credit for that. Following the last U20 World Cup, we wanna be a part of it next cycle, and being a part of any youth World Cup, whether it's the men's or the U17 or U20, it's a great accomplishment. I'm looking forward to it.